তাদের স্বাগত আমি সম্পর্ক আছি আর মাত্র কয়েক ঘন্টা স্পেন বনাম ইংল্যান্ড ইউরো কাপের ফাইনাল ইউরো কাপের মেগা ফাইনাল স্পেন চলতি ইউরো কাপে যেমন পারফরমেন্স করে আসছে তাতে অনেকেই আশাবাদী যে স্পেনই হবে আগামী ইউরো চ্যাম্পিয়ন আদৌ কি স্পেন পারবে আদৌ কি স্পেন ফের একবার দীর্ঘ বারো বছর পর ইউরোপের বিশ্ব সেরা হতে পারবে এই স্পেন দলের একাধিক ফুটবলারকে হাতে তার মধ্যে চলেন কিবু ফিকুনা ওয়েলকাম কিবু ওয়েলকাম টু এক্সেলেন্ট বাংলা ইন দ্য ফার্স্ট বিগ ম্যাচ অফ স্পেন Uh, you are with us with the light chat and you um, you gave me lot of aspect of the Spain team so how do you rate Spain in the final against England? Well I think it's going to be a 50-50 game because uh, it's true that the uh, Spanish national team was the best the, the best team uh, during the competition but you, you know in, in 90 minutes everything happened everything can happen especially England has had very good players, fantastic players that they can they can score in, in every action. No, for the Kane, uh, Bellingham, Saka. But it's true that the uh, uh, Spanish team was the was the best side in the competition. Six games, six uh, six uh, winning games. I'm playing against three European champions: Italy, Germany, France, Croatia. That was in the last two World Cups semi-finalists. And, and England on the other hand, six games, three wins, three draws, drawing against Slovenia, Denmark, Switzerland, and they are good teams but not top teams. And they didn't play against uh, the main favorites, only with Netherlands in the semi final. One of the things is that uh, after the World Cup debacle, Spain team was remarkable. Uh, they, are, they are remarkable in the Euro Cup. So, what is the chemistry of new coach and new footballer? Do you think that? There is a senior junior combination is a build up a new Spanish team? Absolutely. And moreover, uh, the Luis de la Fuente was the, the head coach with this generation under, under 19, under 21 European Championship with uh, Merino, Rodrigo, uh, Oyarzaba, Unai Simon, the, Unai Simon, the keeper, Fabian Ruiz, that is performing fantastic in, the, in this Euro Cup, Kukureya, the left back. So I think, I think that. In some way, he has he has the ability and he has the experience to play in, in the in the group phase in every in every European competition. And moreover, I think that uh, this team won the Nations League, that is a very very big also European competition last year, winning in the with uh, against Italy and Croatia. So they know they know how to win, and uh, they are they are very good team in terms of they are fantastic. Uh, the best team playing, perhaps with uh, with less individualities than other teams. And what's your uh, last match winners uh, against the semi final? Both 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 two goals and they are very connected uh, in their childhood with Lionel Messi. So how do you get the two junior young guns of Spain? Yes, uh, La Viña Mal, fantastic performance with only 16 yards today. His, uh, his, yeah. his, his birthday is 1970, uh, yeah, sorry. And also La Vigna, uh, Nico Williams in the left side, uh, a fantastic performance against Germany, for example, or sorry, uh, uh, Georgia, and, uh, and Dani Olmo. Dani Olmo, arguably, uh, is the best offensive midfielder that the Spanish has. So, as you said before, very good combination between experienced players as Morata, Carvajal, Nacho and uh, matching players as Rodrigo, perhaps the best the holding midfielder in the world, or Carvajal, and young players as the Dani Olmo, Nico Williams, and Lima. The last question is, uh, you have earlier said that it's massive, massive activity, but as a Spanish, uh, what's your soul say, what's your mindset? Uh, my soul is still saying that the Spanish, the Spanish team uh, must, must win, no? and it's, uh, I think, but you know, football is not about football is not mathematics, and uh, and also when you are in the good wave as England, that they, they were lucky in so many games, why not be lucky in the final, no? But if you are asking about which play, which which team is playing better, and which team deserves to win the championship, I think it's Spain.
থ্যাংক ইউ আমরা আদার কোন দেখছি না এক্সট্রা কারণ আমাদের সঙ্গে ছিলেন কি অভিজ্ঞন এবং কি অভিজ্ঞন দাবি হচ্ছে স্পেন এবারের ইউরো চ্যাম্পিয়ন আদৌ কি কি অভিজ্ঞন যে দাবি সেটা কি সঠিক হবে তার মাত্র কয়েক মিনিট অপেক্ষা আপনারা দেখতে থাকুন এক্সট্রা বাংলা আমাদের ইউটিউব চ্যানেলে সাবস্ক্রাইব করুন এবং আমাদের সঙ্গে দীর্ঘ কত গত কয়েক বছর ধরে যেমন হয়ে রয়েছে ঠিক তেমন হয়ে থাকুন এক্সট্রা টাইম लेटेस्ट निज़ और एक्सक्लूसिव भिडियोर संगे अपडेट थकते एखी सबसक्राइब कर यूट्यूब चैनल बेलैकने क्लिक करते भूलें ना जान